In this video, we're going to show you how to do the long tail cast on. To do a long tail cast on, the first thing we need to do is find the point at which we need to create our slip knot. Now to do this, the best thing to do is wrap your yarn around your needle for as many stitches as you want to cast on. It helps give you an indication of roughly how much yarn you're going to need to complete your cast on, but we always add an extra 20 centimeters or so just to make sure you're not going to run out. That's the point where you will create your slip knot and slide that slip knot onto your needle. So we've got our yarn now ready to go to create our stitches and we're going to pop our needle into our right hand. So we hold our right needle in our right hand and our left hand is the hand that does most of the work. In this first stitch, let's watch the video and you'll see the overall technique and then we'll talk you through it in a bit more detail. So you'll use your index finger and your thumb to create a diamond with your yarn. And then your right needle is the one that picks up the yarn, slips it over it and creates our stitches. So we've seen that first stitch being created. Now let's look a little closer and we'll go through step by step. So secure the two strands of yarn in between your third and fourth finger. Then use your index finger and your thumb to create a diamond. Flip your fingers so that your thumb points towards the inside of your work. And then use your right needle to slip underneath the yarn on your thumb. Flip your hands around so your thumb now points outwards and use your right needle again to slip under the yarn around your left finger. Then use your thumb to pull your yarn back over your needle and that's a stitch created. Let's look at that again. So we'll use our third and fourth finger to secure the two pieces of yarn. Create a diamond with our index and thumb. Then use your right needle, point down towards the bottom of your thumb and then slide up and collect that yarn as you go. Then point towards the top of your index finger, slide down and collect that yarn. And then your thumb comes over and you drop that stitch onto your needle. So again, with our diamond, our needle goes down to the bottom of our thumb and slides up to collect our yarn. We flip our fingers and then our needle slides down our index finger, collects the yarn again and our thumb slides that stitch over the needle. And now you've learned the long tail cast on method.